Ladies and gentlemen, it's been nearly two weeks since members of an anti-government militia took over a federal bird sanctuary in Oregon in order to protest at the government's control of federal lands. And the members of this militia, they're heavily armed, they've got AR-15s, AK-47s, and loads of other lethal weaponry that one would expect to find on a bunch of dudes guarding some cockatoos. <laughs> But, <laughs> but this is such a controversial story, even the birds are split on this. <laughs> some are right-winged... <laughs> some are left-winged... <laughs> you know... But, uh, <laughs> Armand Bundy, who is the leader of the militia, has, compa has compared his occupation of the wildlife refuge to that of Rosa Parks. And I think we all remember when Rosa Parks got on a public bus, sat down and whipped out an AK-47 <laughs> and threatened to kill anyone who made her change seats. It's very similar, it really is. Um, but the thing is, the militia are short on supplies and they have released a wish list of items they hope people will donate to their cause. And you have to see this list because these guys did not plan ahead. OK, this is the list they asked for. And on this list, they're asking for four aprons, <laughs> ice scrapers, candles, throw rugs. It's like a wedding registry for the most boring couple you know. <laughs> One of the items on their list is French vanilla creamer, right? <laughs> Which I'm guessing means they originally made a demand for creamer and then a guy with an AK-47 strapped to his chest stood up and went, hey, uh, hey guys, can we make sure it's French vanilla? <laughs> Just, you know, for me. Um, they also, they also asked... Oh, yeah, come on. Thank you. They also asked for a digital camera, and you'll notice it says, with charger. <laughs> which definitely means they've been burned before. Do you know what I mean? Uh, they asked for Miracle Whip and mayonnaise. <laughs> like, just in case you weren't sure if they were white. <laughs> you know, another clue they're white. The government still hasn't stopped them. <laughs> um, but, but out of everything on this list, there's only one thing that they say that they needed badly, right? Eggs. <laughs> Look at that. Is it... <laughs> they need eggs badly at a bird sanctuary, you know? <laughs> but this story has gotten so big and so crazy that people online have actually started writing erotic fan fiction about it, right? <laughs> it tru truly, in fact, and this is completely true, one author actually published an e-book titled Oregon Patriots Occupied My Butt. <laughs> now, which you think is funny, but it's completely ruined what I was going to call my memoir. <laughs> it wasn't a joke. Yeah, it wasn't a joke. I thought it was a joke. It sounded yeah. like well, a don't. joke. This is me. true. <laughs>